while it is known that Boston is not home to the best drivers, tensions are running high in the back bay over how people are driving through the neighborhood. It's much worse than ever. I think people's driving has deteriorated tremendously in the last five years. The intersection of Beacon Street and Fairfield is particularly worrisome to Back Bay residents. Earlier this month, Boston University student Ju Kwan Ju was charged for running the red light at roughly 100 miles per hour. This was the same intersection where a young couple was struck and killed this past June. Definitely unsafe to be a pedestrian. I was running last weekend and I was in the crosswalk and I had a walk light and somebody came speeding down Boylston and I had to run around him to not to avoid being hit and he just he saw me at the very last second. I set up a camera at the intersection of Beacon and Fairfield and caught not one, not two, but three cars run through the light in under 20 minutes. I would put most of the issue percentage-wise on cars. That's the responsible partner. While the Boston police has up patrols in the area, several Back Bay residents are asking for things like red light cameras to be placed in ex intersections like the one behind me. Yet in the state of Massachusetts, for the time being, there is no state law or program set in place that will allow for these cameras. Reporting for BUTV News, I'm Callie Greenberg.